everyone and welcome to our weekly video update from Mark Outlet Seeds. I'm in a field of P9482 SXE BMR corn from Pioneer near Kleefeld, Manitoba. This is our first field of BMR corn actually at Mark Outlet Seeds and probably in Western Canada. Um, it is 94 days so it's on the later side uh, for our area but definitely possible especially on a more normal year. Um, in this particular field the ears are actually maturing very well. We're not quite at that dense stage, so we do expect to chop this for silage in another three weeks or so. Um, but overall, crop health looks really good, actually. Uh, we can expect upwards of 16 tons per acre in here from an estimate uh, that I just did, which is great news. One watch out for BMR corn is uh, weaker agronomics, so it does have a weaker plant, or a weaker stock, I should say, because it's a low lignin, high fiber digestibility product. Okay, so we can see some snap possibly with uh, wind events in the summer, um, as well as disease entry points for uh, Goss's wilt and, and things like that. So that's something to watch out for, but overall uh, in here, it's looking really good. So we're very excited for the evolution of this product to perhaps have uh, lower heat units available in the next few years so we can really stay committed to our dairy community. Speaking of staying committed to our dairy community, we have silage inoculant available right now for our corn silage. So the season is approaching for uh, chopping. And if you have never considered using silage inoculant before, we do have a couple spare applicators at the warehouse that we could set up for you, um, especially for high moisture corn on the yard too, uh, if you've ever thought about that. So if you're interested in uh, corn silage inoculant or high moisture corn inoculant, please let us know. Um, thanks again for coming to our giant customer appreciation last week. We had a lot of fun. It was hot and the uh, meal was great, but man, it was nice to see a lot of our customers and, and we're truly, truly lucky and thankful to have such a great customer base. Um, meant a lot to us. We'd like to highlight the winners from our, our big prize giveaways. So we had Delilah Woodstra win the fishing package. We had Jonathan Lang win the golf package and we had Clinton Beckert uh, with the seed voucher. So thanks again, you guys, for coming and congratulations. Um, we we'll hope to touch base again this fall with all of you. Our team is thrilled to announce our fall tour. Join us on September 14th at 8.45 for coffee with our tour beginning at 9 a.m. The location will be our Otterburn PKP where we visited earlier this summer. We'll be discussing corn, soybeans, canola, and other crops, but there is only one stop on this tour uh, since we want to keep it short and relevant and we know that you want to get back on the combine after the tour. If you'd like to come, please let us know. Corn and soybeans have been maturing tremendously this week throughout our area with soybean fields turning color in the last 3-4 days. I'm in a 75 day PKP in the Kleefeld area here where our P7527 AM is fully dented and we're seeing about a third milk line. Uh, we could expect some silage cutting in the area with some of our earlier hybrids in the next week to 10 days. If you would like a yield estimate or a maturity assessment, please contact one of our team members. We are available. This is a great time of year to get out to the field and take a look. Um, we do have tools also like granular satellite imagery that we can um, install for you. If you send us some field locations, we can get you some images. If you have any questions, please let us know. Thanks so much for watching this week's video and have a great day.